<laughs> is the Jehovah Witness movement part of Orthodox Christianity? And if not, why not? All right. <laughs> This is outrageously easy question to answer, but I think we'll go into specifics later on. I think we should do that. Uh, but Christians believe in one God, one God in three persons, right? That's the Trinity, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. And JWs totally deny this. That's the end of story, right? We just have to end of, this finishes, that is obviously uh, not Christianity. In fact, the JWs uh, organization specifically denied the Christian creed or the Apostles' Creed and the Nicene Creed or any creed that Christians ever uh, had before Charles uh, Russell, before he showed up. For example, one of these main essential beliefs that Christians always believed in is that Jesus is God. In fact, this is how you can falsify Christianity. I mean, if you, uh, the three tenets of Christianity, absolute core of our beliefs is that Jesus died, he rose again in bodily form, and Jesus deity, right? If you remove any part of these tenets or uh, on, on Jesus alone, we're only talking about one part, then it's no longer Christianity. It's end of story. We can't take this any for further. Now, even though JWs believe that Jesus died on the cross from the dead, they deny that he's the almighty God. For example, they also, and you'll see in a minute how much more they deny. They also deny that the Holy Spirit is a person in the Godhead. Um, again, we're going to get into that in more detail later. So JWs believe in a different Jesus. That means they are relying on a different Jesus to save them. Uh, in the same way as Islam believes in a different Jesus, and in the same way as Mormons believe in it. How do you know what's Christianity and what isn't if it wasn't Jesus that defines it? And then to cut a long story short, JWs are a cult in the sense that they are a new religious movement. All right. So the Oxford Dictionary, and I checked this out, says this about what a cult is. A system of religious worship or religion's worship, um, devotion to or admiration of a person or thing. That's per That perfectly fits with JWs because they are totally devoted and put their total trust and energy and belief and confidence in the leaders of this movement without any question. They aren't even allowed to question it. They have this total obsession towards obeying the governing body. Hmm. They've always rejected the orthodox or classical or classic Christian beliefs on all essential issues, not just one or two, and even most of the non-essential issues they disagree on. Basically, it's a group of people who base their new religion on some the, some things that Christians say, and that's it, and then change them all quite dram dramatically in, in some places. There are so many theological differences that uh, that would just surprise people and 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 it's worse than what people think now i i've read um, I, you can kind of correct me on this if i'm wrong that the jehovah witness is similar to the seventh day adventists they believe that jesus is a a transformation of the archangel michael into human form and then when jesus um died upon a, it was upon a stake wasn't it, it wasn't it even upon a cross it's upon a stake yeah. is that correct yeah yeah um, then he transformed from Jesus back to the Archangel Michael. Yeah, yeah, you, you, you know it very well. In fact, um, I think what we could do is take you through all the different uh, theological differences between them and just have a look at what, uh, how different they are. 